Well, elections may be a year away, but the bugle has been sounded. Two generals expected to lead their respective parties in 2014 have started to execute their strategies. In an election where every vote counts, BJP's poll committee chief Narendra Modi has reached out to the minority community in Gujarat government's youth conclave in Ahmedabad. And on the other hand, Congress Vice President Bahul Gandhi has tried to woo women, ensuring 50% reservation for women in All India Congress Committee and also other party wigs. Let's first talk about Narendra Modi. After being termed as a divisive figure, Modi is trying very hard to change that image from a polarizing figure to a more inclusive one. He invited 30 Muslim scholars from across Gujarat to attend government's youth conclave and even allowed his critics to air their views. A known Modi beta, Zafar Mahmood of Zakat Foundation, delivered a sharp speech slamming BJP's neglect of Muslims and Modi's unfulfilled promises. Modi, in his response, promised good governance to minorities. Not only the BJP and Mr. Modi, but the nation as it has failed the Muslim community. So that's what I pointed out. Uh, the schemes which have not been implemented, the discriminations which are being done, the uh, negative uh, views regarding Muslims that have been expressed on the BJP website, etc., etc. Well, if Modi was booing Muslims, Rahul Gandhi is take, talking about women representation. So Rahul Gandhi said that 50% uh, representation should be there in the All India Congress Committee and other party wings. His promise came during his formal interaction with newly appointed party office bearers. During this meeting, Rahul Gandhi said that it's about representation and not reservation for women. 